Have you ever wanted to record or live stream on Yeeps without the limitation of a phone? Hopefully this tutorial will help you stream your Yeeps gameplay to a PC to live stream or record with ease. This tutorial will require a Mac or Windows PC, obviously, and an iPhone or an iPad. Unfortunately, this tutorial won't work if you are using Android, but if I find a way to, I will make a tutorial on how to do this tutorial with Android. Without further ado, hop onto your PC and let's get started. So first, you want to go to your web browser and type in 3U Tools. And it should be this link here. So 3U.com is the link. And you want to go for Windows. If you have Mac OS, use Mac OS. But I'm going to be going with Windows. Tell you where to save it. Just save it to your downloads, your desktop, or whatever. Wait for it to download. And now once it's downloaded, you don't need to use your browser anymore. And you should have this file here. Just double click on it, click yes if you get any pop-ups to allow something. So when you open it, you just need to agree, install. And if you're wondering why the font looks kind of pixelated for me, that's just because I'm using a custom font. Uh, funnily enough, it's the Gorilla Tag font, so yeah. Now you just gotta wait for it to install, which might take a bit. This is safe, by the way. I've been using 3U tools for ages. But just in case, I would recommend having a antivirus like a Vast. A Vast isn't the best antivirus, I know there's better ones out there. But I'm just using Avast because it's free and I don't want to pay for an antivirus and it does the job but it kind of sucks so yeah. Oh yeah, 3 Tools is installed, I'll launch it. So once it's installed, just click launch. Now you can see this is 3 Tools. It's basically like um, an iPhone like tool tool thing. I mean, it's in the name 3 Tools. But yeah, you can have a quick look around with this. But what we want to focus on is 3U AirPlayer. Now when you open it, it'll tell you it'll download it and install it. So you want to go to Toolbox, 3U Air Player, and then just wait for it to download. Here you go, it'll take you to another setup screen. Click Read and Agree, Install. Now it'll install 3U Air Player. Once it's installed, just click Start. And you can close out of 3U Tools now. It will, it will run in the background, but you can just go here. You can just go here and then close 3U Tools if you want. And now you'll be presented with this screen. So uh, it'll tell you to install a driver, do the recommended one, and click install. And now you'll be here. So you have three options, wireless, wired, and DLNA. Now you don't want to use DLNA because that's not gonna, that's not screen mirroring. That's basically just like mirroring like a movie or a YouTube video. You want to either use wireless or wired. I'm going to go with wireless since it's more seamless and easy. And now I'm going to switch to my iPhone to show you what to do there. Okay, so we are now on my iPhone. You just want to swipe down from the top right. And there, sh there should be this icon right here. I'm on iOS 18. It might look slightly different because I'm on the beta for iOS 18. It might look slightly different because the control center is different. But anyways, you just want to click this little icon here with like the two screens and just tap on that. And you might have to wait, but it should appear here and it should say 3U Air Player with your computer name. So just tap on that and then wait. And now on the computer, you should get this screen here. This is where I would have GTag because I usually do Gorilla Tag live streams, but I can change this to the Air Player to this. <laughs> My iPhone's called Nokia 3310 as a troll, so don't, just yeah. So if you just go into Yeeps. And as you can see, I can do a live stream right now if you like. I'm not, this is just going to be a quick rough thing. You, you can like crop the video and everything, customize it however you like. And as you can see, I'm not going to connect to my headset. You can see it's running pretty smoothly. And this is on an old computer, by the way. But yeah, and then you can just like get put on your headset, start the live stream. And then just like, and then you can have your camera view on Yeeps. But yeah, that's how you can connect your Yeeps companion app to your PC to do live streams and stuff. So I hope you enjoyed and hope this helps and I'll see you guys next time.